Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing my August favorites. I want to thank you guys for tuning in today. I'm really excited to share these products with you. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe down below before you leave and we're just going to get right into the video. So this month I actually have a lot more beauty related products, not really a lot of makeup related products. They're just a lot of different things that I have to talk about this month. And the first one being a new body wash that I started using and I started using this body wash by accident because when I moved into my residence hall this year for school I realized that I didn't have any more of my Dove body wash and I usually buy that from Walmart but Walmart is not really the closest store to where I'm living so I ran to Family Dollar just to get something inexpensive to last me for like a few days until I could get to Walmart and get my regular Dove body wash but I actually ended up liking it and this is the Family Dollar brand and everything but this one compares to caress daily silk body wash and it just says body wash smooth as silk and it's white peach and orange blossom so I'm pretty sure that's why I really like it because it smells really good and you guys know that I love anything fruity the next thing that I want to mention is the lotion that I've been using recently I think I mentioned this in one of my other favorites videos but I'm not really sure but I just recently started to pick it up and use it again and this is the organics nourishing coconut milk hibiscus lotion this stuff smells so good i remember i mentioned this along with a spray that i had got that went along with it but i ran out of that spray a long time ago and then i've been having a hard time finding this in the store like i got this from walmart and i also got the spray from walmart but i cannot find either in any walmart that i've been to lately so it's really making me sad because i really love this stuff and i want to repurchase it definitely the spray i ran out of the spray so long ago and i'm ready to repurchase that but I'm still looking for it hopefully I can find it soon and then I have two perfumes that I want to mention to you guys and they're both by Victoria's Secret and these are the two perfumes that I picked up right before I came back to school and I have been loving them and it is the Victoria's Secret Beyond and then Love Addict this is what the Beyond bottle looks like. I really like it. It gives me like cheetah print vibes with the metallic gold and the purple. You guys know purple is my favorite color. And then this is what the Love Attic looks like. So this one is just a little bit more plain. But I've been loving these two perfumes. They smell really good. They're not really fruity scents. So it was something a little bit different for me. I think that's why I'm really liking it right now. Because I've been just using fruity left and right all summer. So finally switched it up a little bit. They have more like not really a floral scent. But I just want to say like a fresh scent to them. And this one has like a little touch of maybe something fruity but it's not like straight up mango like how I've been using for a long time. And then Beyond definitely does not smell anything like fruit. This just smells like a really fresh kind of scent. I wanted to mention the Vaseline Lip Therapy to you guys again because I have not quit using this stuff so I'm still using this faithfully like every day and I cannot put it down. I used to use Carmex before I started using that but Carmex is just I don't know like it would dry my lips out some days and then some days it would make my lips feel really moisturized but I always like the tingling feeling of Carmex on my lips but the Vaseline Lip Therapy once I switched to that I just have fell in love with it and I have so many of them like I have so many backups of these for when I run out because if I run out of these I need it like ASAP because I cannot have dry lips so this is still the lip moisturizer that I have been using and then I wanted to mention the L'Oreal telescopic carbon black mascara I recently got this not too recently but it was maybe like two months ago and I'm not really a mascara person because I really don't have any lashes like my lashes are really thin and short so I really have to coat my lashes with mascara if I want to just wear my natural lashes but I started to use this because I actually started putting on mascara before I put on my false lashes which is something that I never used to do and everybody is like how do you apply your false lashes without putting on any mascara first so I was like you know what I'm just gonna try this one day because I had just been doing it before without putting on any mascara and I was fine but now once I've started using this first and then applying my lashes it does make the application just a little bit easier and 
I guess it just makes them stay on a little bit better because it's giving it something more firm to hold on to because like I said my lashes are really thin so once I put the mascara on them it gives it a little bit more hold and it just makes it a lot easier for me to apply them I wanted to mention my favorite deodorant I've been using this deodorant for way more than just August I've been using this for a very long time but I wanted to mention it because it is ideal for the summertime and I've been loving it for the summer this is the suave 24 hour protection powder Powder aerosol deodorant so this is a spray and I cannot stress how much I love spray deodorant versus regular deodorant just because of the fact that it doesn't have all of the white residue that regular deodorant has and it's just more lightweight and airy and I just feel a lot better when I have it on and I just think that this is perfect for summer because you're gonna wear tank tops and things and you might not want all of that white residue to show under your arms when you lift your arms up so I would highly recommend any kind of spray deodorant but the one that I really like is suave I heard that the dove one is really good so I'm gonna try that one next but I have been using this faithfully for a really long time. I think I've been using this since last summer. I think last summer is when I got onto the spray deodorants because I was watching somebody else's favorites video. I don't remember who it was, but they were just like, spray deodorant is the way to go for the summertime. And I use this year round now. Like I don't even switch it up anymore. That's how much I love this stuff. And the last two things that I have to mention to you guys are going to be hair related. The first one is the Cantu Shea Butter Moisturizing Rinse Out Conditioner. I absolutely love this conditioner. It makes my hair so soft and it smells so good. This conditioner smells so good. Like your hair will be smelling like heaven when you put this on. And this stuff is really cheap. It's like $3 at Walmart. So I would highly recommend this. It makes my hair super soft and it makes it a lot easier for me to detangle my hair because that is always like a process. So I would highly recommend that. And then the last thing that I want to mention is actually the scarf that I've been using lately. And this is just a silk bonnet. This is what it looks like. I showed this to you guys in my braids video and I love this bonnet. Silk bonnets are always the way to go. This right here saves my life at nighttime, especially with all of this hair. Believe it or not, I fit all of this hair into this little bonnet every night. I love this thing just because it keeps all of the hair off of my shoulders, off of my neck while I'm trying to sleep. Maybe if you have like updo styles or styles that you're trying to keep like your edges laid down or something, you won't be able to use this. But for pretty much every hairstyle that I've had, I've been using this silk bonnet and I absolutely love it. It's very gentle. It's not like putting tension on my edges, pulling out my edges, or doing anything crazy or weird. And I believe I got this from Walmart and I think it was like $2. So very inexpensive and you can always use a silk bonnet in your collection of hair stuff because you never know when you might need it but I use this every night I know a lot of people sometimes use different hair scarves and wraps and things like that so this is just the one that I have been using and I have been loving this for not just the month of August but also like before then when I had my braids this was a lifesaver so those are all of the products that I have to mention to you guys I know that was a quick favorites video but I wanted to just mention some of the products that I have been loving this month Please give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel before you leave and I will see you in my next video.